Hey everyone, it's the Cinema Dude, and welcome back to my channel. And we are halfway through my 31 days of Screamtober over on my Instagram page. And uh, today we're actually doing, for the uh, 17th, we're doing a triple feature of Hammer Horror. So I thought, uh, what kind of a good uh, companion would be to look at my Hammer Horror collection. Um, so my Hammer stuff is also outside of it too, some science fiction um, and some kind of adventure films, but uh, let's kind of hop right into it. So um, first, which is, I didn't actually realize this until FX, so this is all kind of my ghost movies. And then the last one here is the uh, Women in Black, uh, the one sorry, Daniel Radcliffe. Uh, this actually was a Hammer production when they uh, re um, came into existence in the uh, mid to uh, late 2000s. So uh, didn't realize that, that that's how it kind of works out. But uh, here are, so I start with some box sets. Uh, the first one I have is this uh, Hammer Horse Series 8 Film Collection. Uh, gives you The Brides of Dracula, Curse of the Werewolf, The Phantom of the Opera, um, Panamic, or Paranamic, sorry, uh, Kiss of the Vampire, Nightmare, Night Creatures, and The Evil of Frankenstein. So kind of a cool set. This was put out by Universal. So there's the back of that one. And then it has the, uh, there are like two on a disc and stuff. So there's that set. As you can see, I'm still kind of going through everything. Uh, then these were the two Mill Creek uh, sets. So the first one is Hammer Films Collection. It has the Two Faces of Dr. Jekyll, Scream of Fear, The Gorgon, Stop Me Before I Kill, and Curse of the Mummy's Tomb. And then this one has... Uh, Creatures, The World Forgot, Never Take Candy from a Stranger, The Revenge of Frankenstein, The Snorkel, Maniac, and Die, Die, My Darling. So there's those. And then we're going to swing over here. Then we have the Icons of Suspense Hammer Films. Uh, Stop Me Before I Kill, Cash on Demand, The Snorkel, Maniac, Never Take Candy from a Stranger, and these are the Damned. Uh, as you can see, it's kind of the same with the other set, except... Uh, cash on demand and these are the damned are the two different ones in this set then we have the uh four film favorites dracula which gives you horror of dracula dracula has risen from the grave taste the blood of dracula and dracula ad 1972 that's from universal kind of a cool little pack and i think these are I'm right. Uh, are they individual? No, they're two sided ones. I thought they were individual releases on that. Uh, then we have uh, this set, but the only one we're actually looking at is the Hound of Baskerville. And that one uh, is the Hammer version with both Christopher Lee and Peter Cushing. Uh, then we have. Hammer film feature set and has Dracula Prince of Darkness, The Legend of the Seven Golden Vampires, and Frankenstein Created Woman. Uh, then this one has Curse of Frankenstein and Taste the Blood of Dracula. A lot of what these Hammer sets do have, like, there are a lot of uh, crossing over because they're in different ones now shout factory is putting a lot of these out individually um so hopefully i'll be able to replace them and stuff uh then we have the hammer collection double feature that has the mummy shroud and the plague of the zombies then we have the lost continent uh Frankenstein and the Monster from Hell. Yeah, I think that's... Yeah, it is. Let me make sure that's the correct title of that. Captain Kronos, Vampire Hunter. This was a bootleg, and now it actually is on official release, but it's The Abominable Snowman with Christopher Lee. And then we have... 
The Curse of Frankenstein. This is the two disc edition that came out. Uh, did it come out last year? Yes. Yes, so that's the two disc one from last year from War Archive. Uh, one million years BC with Raquel Welsh. Uh, Kiss of the Vampire again. The uh, Quater Mass Experiment. This is a Kino edition right there. Uh, the Man Who Could Cheat Death. Another Kino release. Uh, the Satanic Rites of Dracula is a Warner Archive release. And this is the one that's in public domain, um, but this is kind of a nice edition of it. Uh, the Mummy. Now, this is actually kind of funny about this because... So, this release, you can find pretty much for cheap. It's the DVD release of it. The Blu-ray, though, release of this is out of print and actually goes for a decent amount of money, but it's like the exact same release. So it's very strange that the DVD you can find, but the Blu-ray is just out of print. Kind of interesting in that. The Revenge of Frankenstein. Uh, the Reptile. And then Frankenstein must be destroyed. And then swing down here. Uh, we have Demons of the Mind. And the that one actually, I believe, just came out last year, I believe, or the year before. Uh, again, a, a Shout Factory release. Uh, Fear in the Night, same thing, uh, The Vengeance of She, and then uh, finally, Four-Sided Triangle on uh, VHS. So those are my uh, Hammer Horror, uh, so... Um, just want to kind of go through them to uh, kind of show what we were uh, looking at today on the Instagram page. Uh, make sure you follow along uh, on my 31 Days of Screamtober uh, over on my Instagram page. And that is at the underscore cinema underscore dude. Uh, or just search up 31 Days of Screamtober and you'll be able to find me there. Uh, so yeah, so that's my Hammer Horror. Um, let me know in the comments. Uh, is there anything I'm... I definitely know I'm missing a lot, uh, but if there's any that you think definitely need to uh, get some love that I should pick up, uh, I definitely know one of them, Devil Rides Out, definitely need to get, um, and uh, there's a few other ones too. So yeah, comment below, what's your favorite ho uh, Hammer Horror uh, film, what uh, should I add to my collection, uh, just comment below. So uh Keep, uh, like I said, keep checking out the Instagram page for the 31 Days of Screamtober. Uh, and uh, check back next week. Where we'll have another video. Uh, hopefully, I'll be able to have uh, a special guest join us next week. Uh, just making sure that kind of all of our um, schedules kind of are able to combine. So we'll check that out. So uh, thanks for watching this very short video this week. Uh, but I hope you guys are doing well and uh, having a good October. And remember, be kind and rewind. We'll see everybody next week.